Hello everyone, this is Nancy from Nissan LED. When setting up LED display, have you ever run into these issues? For times, the RCG fire just disappears. What should we do? Don't panic. Today I will show you how to light up the LED module and play the video without it. So let's get started. And let's have a look. These are some items that we should be prepared in advance. And these are power supply, LED module, and LED receiving card. These are related cables that we need. We need power supply cable, flat cable, and network cable. And also we need a video processor. The mode we use is Nova Star VX400. And this is the matching cables. And please don't forget computer which we can download related software and set parameters here. Step 1. Connect PC to the video processor. Connect the computer and the video processor using a USB cable and an HDMI cable. Step 2. Connect the module to receiving card. Power on the module with a 5V cable. Connect the module and the receiving card with a flat signal cable. Connect the 5V cable to the receiving card. Step 3. Connect the receiving card to the video processor. Connect the video processor and the receiving card with the network cable. The green light on the communication is blinking, indicating normal communication. Also for the yellow light on the video processor. Step 4. Power on the module using Nova LCT. Please confirm the module specifications in advance and clarify the LED driver chip and decoder chip. Login used the advanced synchronous system user login A mode. Password admin. Select the screen configuration. Check the custom resolution option. Change the resolution to that of your computer. Click set. Then refresh. Check the display settings to see if the resolution matches that of the computer. The scale should be set to 100%. Confirm that duplicate mode is enabled. Enter the smart set in the receiving core set interface. Choose the corresponding mode according to the module I see. You can inquire with the module manufacturer or check the IC label on the back of the module by yourself. Enter the pixel resolution of the module. The module we use is pixel 2.5 and 320 times 160. Select the decoder IC model for the module. The current display module is for black. Select RGB and confirm the module's color matches the selection. Count the number of lead rows on the module and enter the data. Based on the lead LED positions on the module, click the corresponding grid cells. Tips Use arrow keys for faster selection after the initial clicks.
The small set is now complete. Move the mouse cursor. You will observe that the counter displayed on. The module is constant with the computer screen. Okay, guys, so we can see the module has been light up and operate normally now. Power supply, receiving call, module, computer, and video processor. Okay, guys, if you have any questions during the operation or other LTPs you want to know, leave a comment below the video. I'll reply when I see it. Thanks.